homolytic cleavage and heterolytic cleavage. In the case of organic reactions, substrate or the organic compound reacts with an attacking species and form intermediates and these intermediates are highly unstable and they get converted into products. Okay. So, in this case bone breakage or bone cleavage takes place, two types of bone cleavages are homolytic cleavage and heterolytic cleavage. First, let us see what is homolytic cleavage. Homolytic, in the case of homolytic cleavage, the intermediates obtained are free radicals. Okay. Take one example. In the case of CH3Cl, presence of heat or light, then it is converted into CH3 radical and Cl radical. Okay. Another example is Cl2. Similarly, they gets converted into Cl radical to Cl radicals. Okay. These radicals are highly reactive and they gets converted into the products. And the shape of the CH3 radical, let us see the shape of the CH3 radical. Three hydrogen atoms are attached. Okay. There is a lone pair of electron in one orbital. So, this will be the shape of the free radical, CH3 free radical. Okay. And in the case, the non-polar non radicals are obtained and these reactions and the bonds are non-polar and the, these reactions are also called as non-polar reactions. Heterolytic cleavage, the reactions are also called as non-polar reactions. And the stability order of the radicals will be like this. Tertiary is highly stable. Then secondary CH3. This radical is highly stable. Then comes secondary. Okay. Then primary radicals okay this will be the stability order of the radicals okay these are highly reactive and they get converted into the products okay now next cleavage is home heterolytic cleavage in this case hetero atoms are obtained and these cleavage are cleavages are called as heterolytic cleavage heterolytic cleavage In this case, different intermediates are formed and the uh, intermediates obtained are ions. They may be positive or negative and so these uh, reactions are also called as polar reactions. Okay. Since the ions are obtained, take one example. CH3 Cl is converted into the electron pair will shift towards the chlorine atom is highly electronegative and ions formed are CH3 plus and Cl minus. Okay. CH3 plus is called as the carbocation. So, first case is carbocations. Formation of carbocations. They are also are carbon, carbonium ions. Okay. They are also called as carbonium ions. Now, let us see the shape of this molecule. Three hydrogen atoms are attached, okay, and it contains a positive charge, okay. And the hybridization, it is sp2 hybridized, and the shape of the compound is trigonal planar, okay, and the angle between them is 120 degree, okay. And these, uh, these uh, ions are electron deficient. So, they are also called as Lewis acids or electron acceptors. They can ac accept electrons. Okay. 
carbonium carbonium ions or carbocations now what will be the stability order of the ions tertiary will be highly stable tertiary carbocation is highly stable then comes secondary okay then primary then c3 plus okay this will be the stability of order of the compound okay this reaction are also called as polar reactions okay this is the first case now the second intermediate obtained is carbanions okay carbon carbanions are having negative charge okay take one example rcoo na gets converted into rcoo minus plus na okay this rcoo minus again gets converted to r minus that is ch3 minus radical sorry ion and co2 this will be let r be ch3 so this will be ch3 minus now what will be the shape of the compound of the intermediate let us see in this case we can see that four hydrogen atoms are attached and there is a orbital containing an electron pair so the shape of the compound will be like this this is sp3 hybridized okay and the shape of the compound will be pyramidal this will be the second ion obtained okay and these are electron rich so they are lewis bases they are called as lewis bases or electron donors okay so much about the carbanions now the third ion third intermediate obtained is carbenes 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 okay take one example some examples are cx2 two atoms attached to carbon and one bond pair okay one uh, shared electron then ch2 these are some of the examples of carbenes ch2 double bond c double bond o this compound in the presence of high energy radiation it gets converted into ch2 carbene and co okay this will be the carbenes okay now third one is nitrates sorry fourth one is nitrenes 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 example this is an example but another one instead of h r okay these are the examples of nitrenes okay then reaction will be azides presence of h nu high energy radiations light in the presence of light gets converted into n okay plus n2 this will be nitrenes and next the fifth one is benzines benzene another uh, intermediate obtained is benzene and the structure of benzene will be like this all the other cc bond except one will be double bonds this will this will be a c triple bond c okay and it is this only this c triple bond c is sp hybridized and all the other c double bond c are sp2 hybridized okay we can also draw this like this okay this much about the reaction intermediates in the organic reactions